Intimidation tactics won't work on me now. I'm getting on that boat. Caesar. Get your hands off. What? What are you doing? I'm sorry, Nicholas, but I simply cannot allow you to board the haunted star. Date or no date? Nicholas, it's Ivy. Your date? Come find me on the boat when you're done with that friend of yours. I ordered you to let me go. I'm sorry, Mr. Cassidy. Yeah. I'm afraid we can't do you're that. You're my security people. You work for me. They did, but I offered better terms. Really, how big of a raise did she give you? It was with money. We have families. She knows where they live. <laughs> better terms. So, so what now? You're gonna have them shoot me? Throw me in a cage? Oh, Nicholas, neither. Stop it. This, for heaven's sakes, don't be so melodramatic. You ordered these men to seize me. I'm being melodramatic? Let's not argue semantics. I need to keep you far away from that party. Why? Why? What's going down on the Haunted Star you don't want me to see? Don't trouble yourself with the Haunted Star. It's really no trouble at all. Nicholas, allow my men to escort you home. Spend the evening with your son. And be thankful for all you have. You know, there are others who aren't so lucky. But like the people on that boat, why? What's gonna happen to them? Nicholas, I'm trying to spare you. Do you want me to take my place at the head of the family, or don't you? You know that that is my fondest... Then how am I supposed to do that if you don't keep me in the loop with the big decisions? Nicholas, you make all of the important business decisions. And anything, anything involving commerce is your domain. What is about to happen on the Haunted Star? You stick to your area of expertise, and let me stick to mine. Tell me what is going on. <sighs> Find if it will end this childish tirade. <sighs> the haunted star is about to go up in smoke, along with everyone on board. You're gonna blow up the haunted star? Is that what you're gonna do? And everyone on board. My sister is on that boat. Oh, she's not even a Cassidy. What about all those innocent people? What about my date? <laughs> she's not a Cassidy neither. God. Oh. This is murder. Mass murder. I, I, oh, Nicholas, this is absurd. Now stop struggling. No, you'll end up hurting Damn yourself. you. I can't let you do this. I have to get those people off the boat. You are out of your mind. Wait. Oh. Dad. My Dearest Nicholas, always so considerate of the less fortunate. We have to work on that. All right, take him home and hurry. I don't want him anywhere close when that bomb explodes. Still here? I wanted to stay and watch the fireworks. You never could resist a good destructive detonation, could you? Well, it's a good thing, too. I was on hand to prevent my grandson from boarding that boat. Mm -hmm. Impeccable timing. <laughs> Those revelers don't know it, but they are enjoying their last moments on Earth. Dante Falconeri, on the other hand, has mere seconds.